need a doctor We going hard in the paint like Waka Yeah, I was shy about to go kill Manga Precepts busting like a chopper The way he got cut up, he gon' need a doctor What is the gospel? What is the, what is the gospel? What is the gospel? God wrapped himself in flesh came down. Where does the Bible say that the gospel is? It's in Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John it's Is it not before gospel. that? It's everywhere no, 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 throughout. No, 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 no. God is constantly saying, where? I'm going to send someone to, to, to save you. Was, where do we, where do we hear the good news, Jesus brother? Died for you. Brother, he died for you. When Jesus says the, good, the gospel, yes. who does he quote? What, the prophets? The prophets. Right. What do the but prophets? What do the prophets prophesy about? Oh brother, that's not my point. What my is point is the gospel. Yes, Jesus. The gospel is what? The go what does gospel mean? Brother, the good news. Of who? Brother, I am the good uh, not of whom, what? Exactly. The good what news. Is, what is the good, good news? news? Exactly. Perfect. Tell me what the good news is. Yeah. Tell me what the good news is. Uh, no, no, no. Get that in Isaiah. I would love to just talk to you though really quick. Yeah, you are. You are. You are. Without, without the Bible? Okay. No. I'm, I'm going to show you what the good news I'm, is. I'm, I'm, I want to talk to you. The good news? We can sit. The good news? I know the verses, the so good. just talk to me. Just talk to me. Brother. Just have a conversation. When when we have the good news happen, right? Is there going to be slaves for the Israelites? Yes or no? There's going to be slavery. Period. For the Israelites, there's right? going to be slavery. Period. For the Israelites are going to have slaves, there's right? Going to be slaves. Period. You're slave. No, 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 no. The Israelites are going to have slaves according to the good news. Correct? I think that's great we news. We are going to be slaves of Christ. No, not we. I'm saying the Israelites are going to have slaves. Yes. Correct? Though you are Israel, you're not. Israel, because Israel is spirit. Brother, it's not brother. No. Yes, you're talking he about the same woman. Salvation is for all. That's what he's saying. Yes, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm free. saying. It's free. So, so, it's so if it's for everybody, no boast. It doesn't matter what okay. bloodline you so, come from. Hold on, 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 hold on. Don't don't go on a tangent. You're trying to boast Those people, about your race hold on, bro. Those people who make it to heaven and are going to be slaves to the Israelites, how are they in heaven? And why are they slaves? Why are they slaves then? If they are there because of Jesus, why are these people slaves? Why does it matter? They're slaves in heaven. <laughs> why do you care so much about slaves in heaven? Because why are you going to promise salvation to somebody and great news to somebody when they're going to be slaves to another because people? You don't understand. You think slavery is a negative thing. I'm it's... a slave to Christ and I'm happy about it. Okay. Yeah. See, okay. you think slavery... Cool, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Huh? Oh, I'm so happy you guys are setting up right now. Perfect. Let's but check listen, this out. Listen, Let's listen, check listen. this out. Let's check this out. You're so mad. You think slavery is what? You're a slave to somebody. You're a slave of somebody. You're either a it's slave a different, or a It's a different thing, bro. Are we going to be teaching people the laws in the kingdom of heaven? In heaven, you're going to be so overjoyed of being in the presence of God, you're not going to worry about anything else. That's not what I asked you, bro. Are we going to be teaching people to keep the laws in the kingdom of heaven? We won't have to. Because we'll be in new bodies. We'll be uncorrupted. Like, we'll be non new Okay, that's beings. crazy. Can you get Revelation 22 again? Oh, yeah. Here. I got you. Yeah, stand on this side. It's good. And that's what the good news is. And you're so hardened to hear it. You, you're so mad that it's freely given. That you have nothing to boast about. You you can't boast about your it's race. Freely given. It's freely Hold given. Hold on. It's freely given. Everybody. Hold on. It's freely given. But Jesus right. tells us to do something in order to get it. You can't do anything. It's freely given. Jesus said, how do you in inherit eternal life? What did the Messiah say? Not Paul. Not all these people that you want to run to. That's not Jesus or God's word. Right. What did Jesus say? How do you inherit eternal life? Repent and believe in the Lord. Is like, that what repent. Jesus said? Yes, repent. repent. Okay. You have to repent. <laughs> yeah. You're saying, you you're that, saying uh, uh, race. How do you inherit in, it, you're saying, everlasting it's life? It's nothing about race. race. They, no, this is, this is, this is <clears> what <throat> I'm talking about. This is what you're saying. You're saying, oh, the Israelites, this, this, and that. Who cares about the Israelites? The good news of Jesus is the fact that it's for everybody, regardless of Where what did Jesus is. say that, bro? John three sixteen for God so loved the world. Here, 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 hold on. Before we run there, before we run there, before we run there, can you get that everlasting life? Watch. Hold on. You just, you just said Matthew nineteen. John three sixteen. I got you. And he accused you saying that all you got to do is be a part of the Israelites or be a part of a certain race, right? That's what he said. That's what he said. No, I didn't. You said that. I said that. This is what you guys are talking about. When did I say that? When you first introduced yourself, you said you believe that the minorities are the Israelites of God, mm -hmm. right? And, that and that's it. salvation comes to them. It's only for them. But there's nothing that they have to do. It's only for them. There's nothing they have to do, Is though. Is that what you're saying? No, yeah, but you just said I said that. No, you don't have to do anything. You, okay, you okay, you okay perfect, perfect, like, perfect. Heaven is accept the free gift That's what I'm saying. Did Jesus himself say that? Yes. So when they asked Jesus, how do we inherit eternal life? What did Jesus say? Repent and 
believe in the one he sent. Well, let's see what let's see what it is. The thief on the cross completely destroys any notion of whatever it is. Oh. We already went there, bro. All you have to do is uh, it's so easy. It's such good news that you need it. Matthew, no. Why don't you like the fact that it's free and it's given to everybody? Because you're you're making it, bro. Yeah. That's the good news. Matthew nineteen sixteen and seventeen. Okay, Watch this. So, this is Matthew nineteen and sixteen, bro. And behold. One came and said unto him, Good master, what good, should, what good thing should I do that I might have eternal life? Are those actions? Keep the commandments, right? Are those he says, actions? I have done them from a young age, right? Brother, and hold says, on, hold you're on. You're, 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 not, you're missing the point you're I'm getting to. No, brother. Thing, right? Re keep reading. Says, watch, watch, watch. Can you answer the question, though? Could you yes, I'm answering your okay. question, right? He okay. So, says, what is he saying? so, so hold on. one point at a time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go one point at a time. Because you Let's go at one point in time. Yes. Let's just read. Let, let, let's just read the verses. Yes. Let's read the verses. So, so hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. So you, before we, I, we even brought this verse. You said all you have to do is just believe. Yes. And That's I asked you, news. and I asked That's you, what did Jesus tell you to do? And you said, believe. Okay. Let's believe see what no Jesus said. And he said unto him, Why callest thou me good? No one is. There's no God. one. There's, there's no, no one good, good but who? But one. But who? It's a rhetorical question. No, the, the, the first the first thing that we talked about, he said Jesus is God. We had this whole argument right. about that. Jesus is God. But Jesus said, That's but Jesus said, oh, if Jesus is God, how come he didn't say it's okay to call me good then? He never said that. He just said, why he do you said, call me good? He just asked the question. Read that again. Watch this. Watch this. That's crazy. Simple things, bro. What's and he said, about? why callest me thou good? There is none good but one that is God. Not Jesus. Uh huh. But if thou wilt enter into life, keep the commandments. Do what? Keep the commandments. How come you're not doing that, bro? How come you run to everywhere but Jesus' words when he says, if you want to inherit eternal life, which I'm sure you do, sure. keep the commandments. And you're saying, I can't do that. I just believe. John 6, 28. Then they asked him, what must we do? What must we do to do the work God's requires? Jesus answered them, the work of God is this, to believe in the one he has sent. Uh huh. Great. So if the one that he sent tells you to do this, why Great. are you ignoring it? And then continue what he Continue. So so hold on Continue. so so hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on. Thing, right? No, you're missing a lot. What am I but missing? here's the thing: you on? just said believe on the one who sent, yes. who God sent, yes. which is Jesus. Yes. If Jesus tells you to do something and right. you don't do it, are you believing in Him? If He tells me to do something and, and you don't, don't do it, it, do you believe in Him? Can you get Luke six and forty six? Watch this. Is Jesus Lord? Yes. Perfect, man. See how everything just call, comes full circle, bro? Luke 6 and 46. Why, and why call ye me, the, uh, call, why call ye me Lord, Lord? Uh-huh. And, do, is what and do not the things which I say. Make it make sense, King. You're saying I had to say that Jesus is Lord and that's, and that's it. That's, I'm good now. So but you the, the but your, you hold on, no, no, no. Sure. But your Lord said, right. do the things I say, which right. you are not doing. Right. That's what I have a problem I with. I do. I do exactly what he tells me to do. Keep the commandments? I cannot keep the commandments. So how I do you do them? To. I try So to. how can you do them? I try. Which I ones can. do you try to do? All of them. Every single one of them. You do? Yes, I try. Okay, man. Every I'll take it. I'll take your word for it, bro. For sure. I can only take your word for it. Exactly. You know what I mean? Short so here, 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 so, that's so here's the, the thing. News. Despite my efforts, right? God is still If good. you're literally trying to, I'll agree with you. But okay. earlier, this is how I can't say that. I said we're not under it. No, because you said we you said we're done away with, with the Abrahamic and the Mosaic law, right? Said it was abolished. See, look, it says Jesus is the devil. Is that what that says? <laughs> Jesus is the devil. Bro, I, bro, I, I think he, see, that's the problem. You know what you are, bro? You are you are an accuser. <laughs> that's, that's what, what you saying. are. You are an accuser of the brethren, man. The brethren. Okay. That's exactly what you've been doing this whole time. And you just came here, bro. <laughs> and I just got here. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. You literally. A, 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 you, since I've been here, all you've been doing is accusing, accusing, accusing. When I first walked up, you said, oh, 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 oh only because you're of a certain race you get to go to heaven. Mm -hmm. You're making it easier. You're making it easier uh, 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 argument. <laughs> all you got to do is believe. Yes. It's that simple. That's crazy, man. What's so simple? Why, why does that make you so mad? Because you got to keep God's laws. It is impossible for you to keep the law. That is the whole point of Christ. Okay. Is Christ, is, is Christ an unjust man? No. Will he 
will he charge you with something that is impossible? He said yes earlier because we had to believe in him. Will he charge you with something that's impossible to do? Yes. He, he, he will? He tells you to keep the commands. It's impossible for you to keep the commands. So he's an, he's an unjust king. No, he doesn't. It doesn't. He's an unjust king because he charged you to keep, uh, to keep the commandments and be, be perfect like my right. father in heaven is perfect. But you're not perfect. You cannot be, be perfect. Okay, so he charged you. So he's an unjust king. Then. He's not unjust. He is just by you can't have it both ways. perfect. But you can't have it both ways. You know how many times I've said that this you whole can't conversation. Have it both it's like saying, ways, oh, there's yeah. evil in the world, so therefore God is not good. God created evil. That's perfect. Yep. Exactly. He created good, evil, light, and dark. I do right. all these things. Right. I got a word. I got look, right. check this out, right? Second Timothy three and sixteen. All scripture is given by inspiration of God and is profitable for doctrine, reproof, correction, for instruction in righteousness. The word of God, which is the Mosaic Law, right? That right, the ask man you, ask you. Is, is that the, the word, word of God? God? What is the word of God? I'm agreeing with this. Okay, perfect. That the man of God may be perfect, mm -hmm. thoroughly furnished unto all good works. Right. That's what I'm saying, bro. Right. You can't like how you're saying you can't have it both ways, bro. Both the scripture said Jesus the Messiah himself said, yes. You said, he said, believe on he who himself who who was sent, which is right. Jesus. Right. Jesus over and over and over and over again says keep the commandments. You're saying I don't have to keep the commandments. You're not under the commandments. But Jesus told me to keep them. Wh who do I listen to? You or Jesus? Yes, you can listen to Jesus, right? I can listen to Jesus? To you. You Jesus. You okay, here, here's the thing. I told yes. you earlier. Is Jesus, listening to Jesus, is that in the law? Yes. So I no longer have to listen to Jesus according to you because the law is done away with, right? I never said it was done away with. It was fulfilled. He did it. What did he fulfill? He fulfilled I forgot we, we, we didn't touch that. We didn't touch that. That's the whole point of him coming. That's what he fulfilled. Yes. But then later he says, until heaven and earth pass, one jot or one tittle shall. Well, actually, we get that's the same verse, let's actually. Go, go. Matthew 5 and 17. Let's just go there. Matthew 5 and 17. Think not that I come to destroy the law or the prophets. I am not come to destroy, but to fulfill. That's what you're saying, right? Perfect. Yes. Perfect. There we go. Keep going. There we go. You want me to shoot it out? No, no, stay, stay there. Watch yeah. this. For verily I say unto you, till heaven and earth pass, one jot or one tittle shall in no wise pass from the law, to all be fulfilled. What is all? What is all fulfilled? Until everything is fulfilled, yes. we keep the commandments of God. What is all? Until everything is fulfilled. What does that look like? What does it look like? The Bible has said is going to happen. Give us a snapshot. Yeah. A snapshot. Give us a snapshot. What does that mean? The second coming of Christ. How does that look like? Everything, everything that happened. You said the, the second Bible? coming of Christ. Yeah, did he come yet? Coming. Did he come back yet? No, not yet. So, did one jot or one tittle pass from the law yet? Did I say it passed? Yes, you said when everything has been fulfilled. It's been fulfilled. The law has been fulfilled. <laughs> so, did Jesus come back again? Yeah. Uh, come back again? No, right? So, what do we do then? One jot or one tittle of the law, correct? That's simple, bro. Keep going. Watch. Because then it further even cuts that doctrine, bro. Whoso, whosoever therefore shall break one of the least commandments and shall teach men so, we, con. he shall be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. And when I read this to him, he said, why does it matter to you if you're least or the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? That's crazy. Right? Keep going. That's crazy but, about it. You're in heaven. That's, that's, a, you, that's actually bad, bro. What's bad? What's bad? You're in heaven. To, to be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. That's you're like a, heaven. that's like. They, 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 that's like a, 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 a speech, like a, like a, an idiom. So you're Meaning you're going to be yeah, in yeah, bad yeah. straits. So you think we're going to be in bad straits in heaven? What kind of heaven no, is that? No, 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 no. If you do not keep God's laws, and if you teach men not to keep God's laws, you will call least in the kingdom of heaven. Even, on that, point, even, even on that point, even even on that point, even on that point, that's not even a for sure that you'll make it even into ki the kingdom of heaven, right? Because God can destroy your soul, correct? Correct? Yes. Okay, so now you can stay right there. Matthew 7 and 21 in the That's NLT. The That's the gospel. Not everyone who calls on to me, calls out to me, Lord, Lord, will enter into the kingdom of heaven. Keep reading. Keep reading. So, hold on. Keep I will. I will. There we go. So hold on. The main point, or not even the main point, one of the points, not everyone who calls out to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven. Right. Correct? Mm -hmm. So is everybody going to make it in? Yeah. Brother, is everybody <laughs> going to make it in? No, you're not. No. no. So reading. not everybody's going to make it in. Let's keep see who reading. makes it in. 
Only those who actually do the will of my Father in heaven will enter. What is the sure. will of the Father? For sure. For sure. Yeah, yeah. Keep reading. What is the will keep of the reading. Father? Keep reading. Brother, we gotta have a good conversation. We gotta build. Obviously, I'm gonna keep reading. People say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in your name and in your name drive out demons and in your name perform many miracles? Mm -hmm. Then I will tell them plainly, I never knew you. Uh -huh. Away from me, you evildoers. You what? They're sitting you here evildoers. boasting about works. You evildoers. They're sitting here you boasting what, about works. You, you know the They're Greek boasting word? boasting about works. You know what the Greek word there is? He doesn't. He doesn't. You know what the Greek word there is? Okay. Those that practice lawlessness, <laughs> antinomia. Okay. Keep uh, read that translation as a matter of fact. It'll go into it. Right. Not everyone who calls out to me, Lord, Lord, Matthew seven twenty one, will enter in the kingdom of heaven. Only those who actually do the will of my Father in heaven will enter. The will of the God's. Dude, I'm trying to tell them the good news. Oh my God. I'm just trying to tell them the good news. I'm trying to read you the words of Christ and you don't yeah. listen to me. It makes them so mad. The words of the, the, the we read the words of Christ to you and and, 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 and you go you go blank. I go you, blank about what? You go blank and you got that little wheel, what wheel? loading. I've been responding. Yeah, yeah. Loading, loading. No, you haven't. I have. Because he just asked you what is the will of the Father? To believe in the one he said. The will of the Father. Are you sure what the Bible says? What the will what, what the will is? Are you sure? Psalms 40 and 8. I delight to do thy will, yes. oh my God. Yes. Yeah. Thy law is in my heart. Yes. So what is the will of the Father? I'll keep reading after that. To believe in his son. What did Psalms just say the will of the Father is? To believe his son. That's what that said? Yes. I mean, That's sure, technically. Technically, technically yeah, technically. That's keeping the law, but he's skirting around it because exactly. he doesn't want to answer it. That's crazy. On Judgment Day, many will say to me, Lord, Lord, we prophesied in your name and cast out demons in your name and performed many miracles in your name. Yes. But I will reply, I never knew you. Yes. Get away from me, you who break God's laws. Right. Right? Right. Are you breaking God's laws? We all break God's Brother, law Brother, are day. you breaking yes. God's laws? Every day. So is Jesus going to tell you, get away from me, you who break God's laws? No. Why not? Why, what makes you so special? Oh, there's nothing special about me. That's there is, because Jesus just said... No, this is the point I brought up when we were all the way over there. I said, you are boasting about yourself. I never boasted once about myself and anything that I did. I'm talking about... Because you don't Jesus do anything. Because you don't do anything. I haven't done anything. I don't deserve... You don't do anything Christ. that Jesus deserve. told you. You I don't do mean. anything that God told you. Yet somehow you're going to make it into the kingdom of heaven. And as long as you make it into the kingdom of heaven, you're good. Which is a sad thing, bro. You shouldn't be aiming like that, bro. You're purposely missing the mark. What mark did I miss exactly? You said you break all of them. All of them, bro. We break the law. You That's break all of them. We all break You the law. break all of them. I told you earlier, stop saying that if you can't point at something that I'm doing. I said your entire existence is sin. How? You were born in sin. That's what I told you. You don't understand what that means. How am I born into sin? Are According to what you say. I'm asking you a specific a question. Being? You asked me that earlier, brother. Yes. What part being? of it is the sinful part? Your entire being. You. As you exist right now, you're in sin. You were born in sin. You actually, this is what I'm saying. You don't get it, bro. The whole, there's sin around us. You're yes. born into sin. Yes. A man and a woman having sex and creating the baby. Is that sin? Yes. Oh, oh my God. Is that not a commandment? That? What be fruitful and, be fruitful and multiply? Is that a commandment? Wait, what was the is initial? that a commandment? What was the initial? <laughs> is that a commandment? So Jesus, God is going to tell you to do something and then say it's a sin later? The very first commandment <laughs> that he gave mankind is a sin. sin. That is be not fruitful what I said. and multiply. That is not what I said. So what is the simple part? We are born in sin. Right? Born into sin. You're born in sin. Into right? sin. We're born simple beings. You can be a sinful being, right? Is Jesus the only perfect person in the Bible? Yes. Let's get that. <laughs> Man, come with the. Watch this. So, Luke 1 and what? 1 and 67. Oh, actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's way before that. So, okay. I'm going to start from the top to get context, right? Luke 1 and 1. For as much as many have taken in hand to set forth in order a declaration for, of those things which are most surely believe, believed among us, 
even as he delivered them unto us, which from the beginning were eyewitnesses and ministers of the word. Mm -hmm. It seemed good to me also, having had a perfect understanding of all things from the very first to write unto thee in order, most excellent Theop uh, uh, Theophilus, mm -hmm. that thou might, mightest know the certainty of those things when thou hast been instructed. Verse 5. There was in the days of Herod, king of Judea, mm -hmm. a certain priest named Zacharias uh -huh. of the course of Abia, uh -huh. and his wife was of the daughters of Aaron, uh -huh. and her name was Elizabeth. Uh -huh. These were the parents of John the Baptist. What's your name, bro? Derek. So you know that uh, you're talking about the parents of John the Baptist. Okay. And they were both righteous before God, uh -huh. walking in all the commandments and ordinance, ordinances what? of the Lord blameless. Were they, were they blameless or did they have sin? The Bible just said they're blameless and they walked in all the ordinances. Why are you adding a sin onto somebody who the scripture just said is blameless? So when a high priest at that. Says, right? A high priest. Righteous. When God says no one is righteous, not even one. Oh, they don't count? Brother, so what do we do then when we see all these people I'm called? You a question. Did you when God says no one is righteous, not even one. But then later turns around and calls David perfect. Oh, there we go. So you tell me. Which one is it? You I'm asking you. Okay, so that's the thing, bro. That specific verse that you're quoting, I believe, is Isaiah. Right. Right? In Isaiah's time, mm -hmm. right. people were being lawless. Yes right. or no? Wicked. Wicked as hell. Right. Right? Does that now negate the fact that David was perfect, that Job was called perfect, that the high priest here was called perfect? Which one is it? Because apparently God contradicts himself if I look at it That's in your lens. Clearly, he does? Clearly he does. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying wow. God said that no one is righteous before him. So these and verses like this. There are righteous people I didn't say that. can boast about it. God just, the scripture of God just said, this man was perfect. Right. You're and saying he's wife. not. Like Job was righteous, right? But then he goes on to say that no one is righteous, not even one. And he had just explained to you that was in what, Isaiah? Isaiah's time, yeah. Oh, so up until Isaiah's time and then moving forward, right? Well, why did he go into captivity? Why did he go into Babylon? Why did the Northern Kingdom get taken into captivity to Assyria? If righteousness... No, no, answer the question, Derek. Couldn't tell you, right? If because they were being wicked. Hold on, because they right? were being wicked and they were breaking God's laws. Isaiah was talking, oh, when he was talking about Isaiah at that time, because they were being wicked, the children of Israel were being wicked at, at that time. No, no righteous, not one. But then he turned around, before that, called David righteous, called this man and his wife perfect. Galatians 2, 21. If righteousness could be gained through the law, Christ died for nothing. Okay. He died for nothing. The whole point of Christ coming. Am I saying your entire So no, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It because does. because here's That's the thing. The whole point. Here's That's the difference. The here's the difference. I got you. If I believe you're saying I had to believe in Jesus, right? Yes. If I believe in Jesus, but don't do anything he says, do I really believe in him? When you truly believe in him, uh-huh. You change. You're why haven't you? Who hasn't changed? You! I'm, trying to tell you. I'm not who I used to be, and that's because of Jesus. But you're but, but here's the thing, you I can be perfect because of the law. No, that's the, is if that what I said? Is that what I said? Achieved through the law. No, 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 no. You misconstrued. You're misconstruing what I'm saying. You're misconstruing what I'm saying. What was the point of Jesus coming? What was to the dying point? for your sins? Exactly. But that does not mean but keep sinning, bro. Achieved through the law, correct? It comes from believing in Jesus. But Jesus told you to keep the laws of God. Right. My boast is in Christ. Your boasting is in keeping the commandments. I, my boasting is in doing what God told me to do, right. which is believing in His exactly. Son, and His Son told me to keep the laws of God. That's what I'm doing. Like I said, if you're denying His deity, you deny everything about Him. But here's the thing: you are accepting His deity according yes. to you, but denying what He told you to do. And then God, <laughs> and then Jesus, not, who is I'm God? It. I'm admitting it, but He's still good. His righteousness is accredited to me. So here's the thing. You know what? You know what's crazy? When we walked up, I heard you talking to the Jehovah's Witnesses, right? Yes. We were there for a little bit. Yes. And then you said something along the lines of, I don't know what he asked you or what you asked him, but then you said, I see people suffering, right? I said that. You said, I still see, there's still people suffering. Yes. Right? You remember? What did he, what, how did that conversation lead up to that? Uh, I came up to him and I said, how can someone be the son of God and not be God? And he couldn't answer the question. Just like, you cannot answer the question. The what? Because you do not understand. And that's okay. 
right? What, what question? Bro, like, we God, talked about that like for like an hour, bro. What question? Right? What was the question? The, he said, how... How can he, someone be the son of God and not be God? Because he is the son of God. He's separating himself from the Father. Those are two distinct people, beings, right? Even in your belief. One God. Even yeah. in your belief. Right. Yeah. Three persons, one himself being. Right? Three persons, one being. Right? Okay. One times one times one. Not one plus one plus one. Okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> Let me ask you this. You walk into a room and you see God. How many people you see? You would see Jesus.